हेलो एवरी वन माई नेम इज अक्षय डिंबर सो अवर टॉपिक इज सिमुलेशन ऑफ सिंगल फेज ए सी टू थ्री फेज ए सी सोर्स सो अवर ग्रुप मेम्बर्स आर अक्षय डिंबर समृद्धि गाड़े गौरव पानगवनी एंड तन्मय घाटे सो सिंगल फेज टू सिंगल फेज ए सी टू थ्री फेज ए सी कन्वर्टर इज ऑल्सो नोन एज फेज कन्वर्टर दिस इज अ डिवाइस दैट ट्रांसफॉर इलेक्ट्रिकल पावर from single phase source to three phase output this conversion is essential in situation where uh, three phase power is required in a industry uh, for uh, for machinery or applications uh, but but which is not readily available so the converter facilitates the efficient operation of three phase uh, converter enabling a broader range of industrial processes and in enhancing power distribution systems so the main application of this is uh, we can reduce the le- length of transmission line uh, thank you hello my name is uh, tanmay vaibha bhatia roll number 19 uh, here is the uh, here we can see that full bridge rectifier the ac voltage source are connected and uh, the input of ac voltage source is uh, we can show the configuration of the ac voltage source uh, 50 hertz frequency and one, uh, 143 is the peak voltage for the ac single phase input and uh, after that we have uh, after that we have connected the uh, diode uh, four diodes and after the diode we are connected the capacitors uh, capacitors and after that we have connected the uh, volt, voltmeter uh, we know that uh, a full bridge rectifier circuit is used to uh, convert the alternate current ac current to dc current uh, in that uh, four components uh, it means four diodes are used in a full bridge rectifier Uh, and uh, one uh, uh, ac power supply are used full bridge rec- uh, the configuration of full bridge rectifier the diodes are arranged in uh, square or rectangular configuration two diodes from the upper, uh, two diodes from the upper half bridge uh, and the uh, other two from the lower half bridge uh, input the ac input is connected to the uh end of the bridge of the configuration here we can see that and uh, after that the output the result uh, the result is the dc output uh, dc output across the load resistor it means uh, here uh, after the uh, rectifier here we can get the uh, uh, dc output and uh, here we can uh, we, here we are connected the voltmeter to connect uh, to uh, measure the output this the output uh, advantage of uh, full bridge uh, rectifier provide a more effective uh, conventional of ac to dc thank you uh, next slide will uh, next will be presented by the samruddhi hello i am samruddhi vijay gade now i will explain the igbt and inverter first of all what is igbt igbt insulated gate bipolar uh, transistor which is used uh, it is a semiconductor device as used is a switch in power electronics igbt is a act as a act as a switches to control the flow of current they can uh, they can handle high voltage high voltage and high current making them the suitable suitable for power applications here we given the dc supply and the uh, we given here we given the dc supply here we use the uh, 6 6 igbt there are three terminals first is gate collector and emitter then we given the supply to the uh, three phase vi vi measurement measurement here we given the three phase supply then we give the that that three phase supply to the here d d uh, multiplexer is there and here scope is connected to the d multi uh, d multi uh, flexer and here display the uh, graph of that uh, uh, graph of that uh, voltage then here we ground uh, grounding the uh, we, here we uh, three phase three phase r r series load is connected and ground ready 
Hello, my friends. My name is Gaurav Pangani. Uh, now I am going to explain you the gate circuit, the gate driver. Now see, we have taken three phases R, Y, B. Uh, from the R five, uh, R phase is reference signal. Now first of all, we get uh, now see frequency is two five uh, fifty hertz and uh, phase difference is zero. Uh, phase difference is zero means uh, we have taken the first zero, and now in Y phase, we have taken. The uh, two pi by pi three means one twenty degree apart from the first signal. That's why uh, that is R signal. Now at same edge, uh, we have taken all the um, signals from one twenty degree apart from each other. Now see here it is. Uh, we have added re uh, repeating sequence. Repeating sequence. It is nothing but the signal uh, which having also a mag a magnitude one to minus one. Here it is, uh, you can see, and it has frequency six thousand. Now see, uh, we have taken all the signals to the demultiplexer. Uh, sorry, multiplexer. This multiplexer uh, will uh, forward this uh, signal to the scope. Now you, uh, we can see here how it is uh, look like the signal. Uh, here you can see uh, yellow, uh, uh, red, and blue. These are the R Y B phase, and this green, uh, greenish. Uh, this greenish signal is a repeating signal. Uh, now see, uh, this R Y B uh, is uh, now connected to the uh, relational operator. Relational operator is nothing but the comparator. It compares the value to the uh, given uh, sawtooth uh, means our repeating sequence signal. Uh, it is uh, when the greater than and is equal to the value of signals uh, to the uh, 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 to the uh, reference signal. It will uh, create the signal and forward to the forward to the uh, switching devices. Now see uh, here we uh, have uh, used from and go to for the signal uh, to the IGBT. Now we are uh, here is not operator, not logical operator. Uh, it it maintain the uh, opposite value to the uh, uh, given value. Now see uh, when S1 is uh, switching on, the S4 is uh, diminished. Uh, uh, same as all the signals are uh, these are the switches uh, to the uh, insulated gate bipolar transistor uh, that is uh, it gives minimal uh, voltage signal and uh, then IGVT will be turned off. Uh, it is nothing but the switching uh, switching on and switch off characteristics of the signals. This will uh, drive the all the IGVTs and we can give uh, we can get the three phase uh, uh, three phase one twenty degree apart from each other supply. Thank you. So here, there, here, this is a AC source connected, and uh, this AC is converted into pulsating DC, and uh, this is by using uh, diode capacitor circuit, and these are the diodes connected. So this DC is converted into uh, three phase uh, three phase AC by using rectifiers, and here are uh, some IGBT switches uh, which are uh, which are. Uh, which are given in the three phase inverter circuit and uh, this uh, this is uh, waveform output waveform so this is a uh, output waveform thank you so talking about the simulating this is a uh, ac source and this AC is converted into DC, and this is the rectifier circuit. So this uh, DC supply is go gone toward uh, this. Uh, this is a three-phase inverter circuit, and this uh, from this DC supply is uh, gone, and this uh, three-phase output waveform is formed. So we can see this three-phase output waveform. So thank you.